Hello, 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 hello. This is Rich Kale here on YouTube, Rich Gen X Elsewhere. And it is time to continue on Avowed. Well, we are very close to ending this, this adventure. In fact, we have taken care of all of these. So now it is time to do the last thing that must be done. I don't know. Level 40? Maybe 50? I beg your pardon? Yeah. KK's wondering what level you'd be if you were in Trollgate. <laughs> I see. Don't you just love these conversations you come into the middle of? So many great bars in Brooklyn and we didn't walk past a single one. I call that a blessing. Indeed. Anyway, what's up? see KK again. Because KK is cute. I think we made a good call with Stan, although maybe not the right one. I yeah. know what addiction is like. Sometimes you're not even aware of the damage you're doing until it's too late. Yeah. If Stan Bates gets the help he needs, then maybe he'll be okay. Maybe. Either way, what's done is done. If it turns out we made the wrong call, we'll try and make it right. Amen. Listen, I can't begin to relate, but I do know what it's like to have feelings you want to drown away. Yeah. So my advice? Focus on the job ahead. That's enough to get you through today. And worry about tomorrow. Tomorrow. And I'm here, if you ever want to talk. Okay. Right. And KK too. Yep. Sorry. Okay. Sure. We'll chat later. All right, my Mandala. No, 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 no. I want to talk to Mandala. Uh, hello. I was just... Processing the events of last night. Yeah. I have no memory of what transpired in the creative force. Perhaps it is better that way. Maybe. Regardless, it was good to see Calliope again. I will always have a fondness for her, wherever fate takes her next. Hmm. Yes, I can see how that might be confusing. Yeah. Some unsolicited advice from one half spirit to another. Yeah. There is no right answer. Your only option is to just let yourself be yourself. You mm. are you. No more, no less. Okay. For what it is worth, Stan Bates spoke the truth. He does not intend to cause any more harm. But convictions mean little without the action to back them up. Thus far, Stan Bates has been lacking in that regard. Yeah. I can only hope he proves otherwise. Same here. Thank you. I want to go down to Eli. Then we'll get this meeting started. Uh. Oh, hi. Sorry, I was a bit distracted. It's okay. Mandana told me about your encounter with Calliope. So I've been reading some old scrolls about muses. Yeah. Most of the scrolls in the library of Alexandria were Greek. So you can imagine there's a lot on the subject. Yeah. I can't imagine what that must be like. I'm sorry, but I do know that demons don't act like you do. They're chaotic, mindless. Were you a demon before? Sure, maybe. But you're not a demon now, and that's what matters. That's all that matters. Yeah. I'm glad we didn't kill Stan. Really, really glad. But leaving him with his power? I just hope he figures it out before someone else dies. Amen. Right. See you. All right. Let's talk with, uh, Vicky. So now we must get started on So say. muses exist, and they can kill people. Yeah. It's a toughie, right? Is Stan guilty of keeping a lethal weapon if the weapon is literally a part of him? I suppose letting him go felt right, but was it actually right? Eh, whatever. We made a call. Whatever happens, happens. Okay. Look, I get it. Things are crazy and you don't know which end is up. You want to have a meltdown and drink yourself stupid. Mm -hmm. And when this is done, feel free to do that. I'll even join you. Hell, I'll buy the first round. But right now, we need you focused. I need you focused. Okay? 
Okay. Okay. Right. Cat. All right. So now that we've talked to everyone about that last mission, let's start a meeting. We need a meeting. Uh, hello. I was just processing the events of last night. Yep, I know. I have no memory of what transpired in the creative force. Regardless. Yeah. Let's start a, a meeting. A meeting is not necessary. We know our mission. We know our destination. Yeah. When you are ready to proceed to the subway, we will follow. Okay. Thank you. Then let's go. We have only one place left to go. Come on, everybody. Come on, Vicky. The Bricks Theater. I mean, yeah, KK. I agree. We shouldn't sit this one out. Yep. Agreed. This is not the time to splinter our forces. Amen. Well, I just had to here's do it. our stuff. Let's get moving. Yep. So. Yeah. Yeah, we did it. We can open this up whenever we want. All right, then. So, what's on the other side of that thing? It is impossible to say. It could be anything. It could be nothing. Pocket yeah. realms can completely ignore the laws of nature, or invent new ones entirely. So, be prepared for anything. Alright, you ready for this, Vicky? Okay, real truth? No, I'm not ready. Yeah, the other might. step through a portal into another world. I could never be ready for that. True. But, I'm a Santina. I finish what I start. So, let's finish this. Alright. Any thoughts before we go? Yeah, I was thinking, not a single person in the program would judge me if I picked up a drink right now. <laughs> but that's not true, is it? That's just the addiction. Making excuses and twisting the truth. So all I can yep. do is focus on what's in front of me. Which means going through that glowing hole and stopping whatever's on the other side. And that's enough for now. It'll have to be. Yeah. Eli? Ooh, I always have words. I was just thinking, wasn't that long ago I was throwing lightning at you on a rooftop? A lot has changed since then. You've made some tough decisions. Decisions I'm not sure I'd have been able to make. I guess all I have to say is, whatever happens in there, I've got your back. And I know you've got mine. Sage advice, Mandana? I have lived a long time, but I would hardly call myself a sage. If anything, I know how easy it is to reinvent yourself. Rediscover who you are, over and over. You have done much the same in your time with us. My only hope is that you do not change further. Regardless, Amen. know that I am with you for as long as I can still stand. I like that. Okay, let's ask KK. She says she's getting bored with all this talking. <laughs> Sorry, KK. We'll get going in a minute. All yes, right. it is time. Eli, shall we open it together? All right. On three. One, One two, two, three. Three. Um... Did something go wrong? I think so. Yeah, we definitely went through. I, I felt it. So did I. Something is different. Hmm. Hmm. Something is different, but what? I don't see anything different. Um, not... Okay. Vicky? Sorry, I have... Okay. Did something go wrong? I don't know. We keep moving, I I admit, I am confused. So am I. I don't know. Let's go out. Whoa! Um, holy shit. This is bad. Oh my we're God. we're not in New York anymore, are we? No. no. We made it into the pocket realm. It is a twisted version of our city. Yeah. That building. Look at the energy pouring out of it. That must be where our quarry lies. Yeah. Um, are you all right? 
Uh oh. Oh man. Creatures of fire, creatures, spirits of air, denizens of darkness. Uh, this is what Vicky. This is what the real one did. Focus on fire. Up! Wake the hell up! <sighs> okay, she's back. Everyone relax. Yeah, you what blacked happened? Blacked out for a minute. You started chanting. What happened? Uh, Yvette was trying to cast a spell. I can cast it now, too. A spell? What kind of spell? Not sure. It sounded like a spell of summoning. Whatever uh, it is, maybe turn the other way the next time you cast it. Yeah. Spell of summoning. Okay. So now we have a summoning spell. Jesus, listen to that creaking. Oh, man. This thing is being held up by spit and staples. Yeah. And maybe a prayer or two. This bridge was created out of sheer force of will. Yeah. It is only as stable as the one who created it. Let's see. Yeah, that's not exactly encouraging. Yeah. Huh. This world was... I wonder why. Yeah. This world was created by sheer force of will. The bridge was constructed this way by design. I wonder why. Steel and concrete. This thing couldn't be more fireproof if it tried. We're with yeah. you. Let's keep moving. Yeah. Do we make a rope? Form a human chain? It seems mm. stupid to come this far only to be stopped by this. Yeah. This world... So how do I cross a bridge? <sighs> Nature? Look, Whoa. Marissa, is that you? It's not enough you keep me trapped in this tiny grove, but now you taunt me in my mind. Uh-huh. You're... you're joking, right? You must be desperate. What in the name of the Holy Green do you need my help for? Need help crossing. I cannot set foot on that bridge, so. Okay. Goodbye. I picked the wrong one. <sighs> okay. Fire. Ice. Ice. What? Who is that? Oh, it's you, Mel Carissa. Have you come to collect your favor at last? Uh, yeah. Well, a bargain was struck. I will honor it. Very good. To the best of my ability, of course. Now, All right. What do you see? Yes. Yes, I can. Okay. But be sure. Is this the favor you want from me? You will not receive another. Uh. Thought so. Okay, so we know he can help. All right. Um, let's see. Oh. Summoner, you contact me across the void. Yes. I am in the middle of battle. You are distracting me. Speak quickly. Yes. Uh. My help. Yes. I suppose I owe you a boon in exchange for sparing my life. Yes. What do you want of me? And be quick. I can do this. Oh! Oh, Jesus, not this guy again. I have no quarrel with you, nor any of your kind. I can carry your group across the gap. Now hurry, my army needs me. Okay! That! It Save this one. done. Now I consider my debt paid. Okay. Goodbye, Sumner. Do not contact me again. All right. That worked. 
All right, we gotta cross that. Whew, glad to be on solid ground again. Not that anything in this place can be called solid. Yeah. Where are we, anyway? Oh, boy. The map says you are here. Yeah, but where's here? That doesn't answer my question. Where is here? That many paths, many... These streets make my brain... Mm. All right, well, let's take this way, see what we're doing. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Look at this place. It's like a ghost town. Come on. Really? Yeah. Everything's boarded up. Did anyone live here? I don't know. Doubtful. This was created for appearances. Yeah. As for why and to what purpose? I do not know. Not for nothing, but didn't we pass that building already? Okay, we need help. Not gonna be of help. Um. You, I'm enjoying my respite at last. Why do you disturb me? Um. You showed me a kindness when you had no reason to. Yeah. But in your world, I have no tangible form. I only exist in the world of the dead. I will be of no help to you. <laughs> okay, let's try focus on art. Is that? Yes, it is you. I hear you across the void. Hey, what is it you need? Of course, I owe you my life and possibly my soul. What is it you need? Well, we're a bit lost in some kind of. Can you Someone help? created that maze, correct? Then I should be able to read it. Go to the entrance to the maze and summon me there. Okay. Right. Let's get back to the beginning. Doesn't this all look a bit familiar? familiar? Yeah, it does. There we go. Um, how do we end up back here? I don't remember doubling back. Yes. Of course. I owe you my life. Okay, a bit lost. Someone create that. Yes, I believe I can help you. Bring me over. All right. This place, it's, it's strange, and yet it makes sense. There was a guiding force, a reason for it all. Yes. And what reason is that? Yeah. This maze has no solution. It's a trap. Ah. Yes. Let me see here. Yeah. Have you tried pressing that button? Button? What button? Ah, I see. This map was deliberately designed to hide the button. Oh. See? It's quite obvious when you know it's there. Ah! Oh, you are welcome. More than welcome. Now, if you'll excuse me, the Prospect Park Writers Group begins in ten minutes, and they're expecting me. Okay. Well, that's um big. Yep. Not to mention cold. I should have packed a warmer jacket. Yep. And I think I know who to summon for this one. Focus on fire. Mm. Master, is that you? I can hear you, kind of. Where are you? Ah. Uh. I need your help, Jordan. Can I summon you here? You mean, transfer me across the void again? It wasn't a pleasant experience, but I do owe you for helping me. Yeah. So yes, I'll help you. Just the once. Okay. What do you need? Giant ice gate is blocking our way. Can you melt it for you us? You need something melted? Sure, I can do that. Easy. But, are you sure that's what you want me to do? I only want to do this once. Okay, let me know if you change your mind. Okay. Same here, Master. You take care of yourself. I wish you wouldn't call me that. Hmm. Uh, 
focus on... No, that's uh, fire, ice. Water, he's done. Nature, don't know if she can help. Robin Goodfellow, at your service. Hello, Robin. Uh, well, a bargain was struck. I will honor it. Now, what do you seek? Can you open this ice I am gate? a fay of the Winter Court. Of course I can open a gate made of ice. Okay. But be sure, is this the favor you want from me? You will not receive another. Okay, we'll find... All right. I don't know... It, maybe the dragon? I could try the dragon. I don't know. Maybe nature can help. I don't know. What is it now? You're... You're... What in the name... Can you help us... Get... And do you want me to do... What exactly? Okay. Have you forgotten? I... Goodbye. So she can't help... I doubt the dragon can help, but I'll ask. You, I. Can I? You, but in your world, I will be of no help. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, I am going to. Uh, You mean so you, what do you, you need but yeah please melt the ice all right that helps is that all you need sure Jordan that's everything I'd better be getting back good luck yes. with well everything yeah all right let's move on my dad's got a weed whacker in his garage. Never thought to bring it along. Yep. These thorns would quickly make short of any mundane device. Alright. Yeah, and my dad would never let me hear the end of it. Probably better off. Indeed. Well, don't worry. Now we have something for nature. What is it now? Yeah. you What in the name of... <sighs> Yes. You're lucky I'm so damn bored or I'd tell you to go to hell. <laughs> Fine, send me over. <laughs> Clumsy work. Engineered by force of will, not by the whims of nature. Yeah. It will be my pleasure to destroy it. Thank you. There. All taken care of. Now, if we're done, I'd prefer to get back to my grove. Go ahead. We have been doing quite well here. Way is clear. Hmm. You okay? No. No, Logan. I am not okay. What's wrong? We just accepted help from my father's murderer. I know. Well, not. But technically. I must face the task at hand. I will deal with these feelings later. Technically, uh, well, let's not go there right now. Who is it, Logan? Yeah. My name... My name is Zach Tiller. Where is my muse? Where did she go? Oh, boy. It's you. You have some nerve coming back here. I just wanted to put on a play. Just a stupid play. Did I deserve to die for that? Did you have to kill me for that? Guys, uh. listen. This is all... You just have to listen. Uh-oh. Geist! They're going Geist! Stop them, Logan! I'm trying. Come on, guys. Just calm down. Calm down. Uh, I got... We need, uh, the dead. You. I am enjoying my respite at last. Why do you disturb me? I'm you here. I need your help. You showed me a kindness when you had no reason to. But in your world, I have no tangible form. I only exist in the world of the dead. I know. I will be of no help to you. Actually, we have a poltergeist problem. Could you help with that? Ah, corrupted spirits. Yes. I believe I can be of some assistance. Yep. 
definitely need that. Uh. Wait, what? What happened? Was that the dragon from Chinatown? Yes, it was. Whatever he did, it did the trick. The ghost passed on. They're at peace. Good. Damn, that bitch caused problems. This place. First it freezes you, then it tries to roast you. All right. Well, we only have one more helper to call on. Robin Goodfellow, at your service. Yes. Well, a bargain was struck. I will honor it. Now, what do you see? Can you do anything about this oh, love? I am sorry. I am a... Damn it! Crap, I used the wrong one. Can't do it. Please. I need... Oh, man. I used the wrong one here. Uh, water. Shit. Crap. That lava is fluctuating between 1800 and 2300 degrees Fahrenheit. Don't go near it. I wish I didn't have to. Lava is more earth than fire. But there is one thing I can do. I, I can to... pull the heat from it. Solidify it. Make a bridge. Yeah. You don't sound so positive about that. Oh, I can do it. But the lava is moving. That makes the job exponentially harder. It's gonna take a lot of energy. Probably all my energy. So if I do this, I'm gonna be tapped out. Completely. It's your call. Should I do this or not? We have no choice. I thought as much. Here I go. I wouldn't have asked. Come on! I'm... Are you all... I'm... Fine. Easier than I... Jesus, are you okay? Who? Me? I'm fine. Liar. Okay. I just used up a bit more than I should have. Need to recharge. Go on. I'll just wait here. Alright, Eli. Alright. We're getting close to the end of this mess. Damn it! Alright. I wonder if, uh... Nothing! We are almost there. Let us continue. Yeah, but we got a problem here. Well, I'm not a demon, I said. It is not a demon. When it speaks, it lies. Like all of its kind. Uh, what the hell are you guys? We encountered one not long before you joined us. He like called it a ligamental. Ligamental? Yeah, yeah, that fits. Yeah. A beacon was formed, leading the way to this world. We followed it. Oh boy. Nothing. Damn it! It's tries magic. Easily countered. What a vile thing. Oh man. What are we waiting for? We are all starving. Attack! How many of you are there? You had to ask, didn't you? Yeah. Any time now? Almost there. I am close. Not one of you can as we said. Kill them. Now! The time for talk is over. Okay. My fucking pleasure. At last. Let us proceed. 
Yeah. I failed. Damn, that was close. Oh no, not another one. Five? Six? I'll stay behind. Um, no offense, but you're not armed. Okay, um... You got this, Vicky? I've got four full clips, if that's what you mean. Just get up there and do what needs to be done. I'll hold them off. Alright. El Caressa. You finally made it. You had to leave some of your friends behind, but you made it. Yeah. <sighs> Did you really think we wouldn't come after you? I couldn't be sure. I hoped you would. This is my world. You're only here because I want you here. Uh, what are you talking about? Think about it. I lit up my stronghold like a Christmas tree. I literally told you where to go. It would have taken you years to find me, if you ever found me at all. You're on top of the Empire State Building. It's not exactly hard to notice. Yeah. Now we're all New Yorkers here. How often do you even notice the Empire State Building, let alone go up there? Hmm. So you wanted to come here. Why? This was wrong, Malcarasa. Wrong to leave you in the dark the way I did. We should have worked together. We should have been partners. No. I thought I could do it all on my own, but I can't. I need your help. The knowledge that you contain. Merge with me again, willingly this time. We'll be equals, and we can build this world together. I cannot detect falsehoods from spirits, but this must be a trick. It has to be. I'm all for second chances, but this takes it a bit far. Yeah. makes you think I'd be agree. Who are you to judge me? I share your memories. I know everything you've done. You let that fire elemental go. He torched an entire homeless shelter. And General Zarag of the Merfolk? He slaughtered dozens of people. You barely gave him a slap on the wrist. You even let Galen of the Northwoods go. And she killed your leader. And let's not forget Robin Goodfellow. He kidnapped kids, and you let him walk? In exchange for what, a favor? Give me a break. And what about Stan Bates? He brainwashed people into killing themselves, including a little girl, and he's walking around free. You've been consistent with Mercy so far. Why stop now? Uh, yeah. Those were all impossible situations caused by you. The only situation is the one you're looking at. I want to create another world. But this time, it's going to be done right. So help me, Melcaressa. Please. Look, you can't run from this. You killed people. Yeah. And that's not even the worst of it. You didn't just take people's lives. You twisted their souls. Made them into something nasty and dangerous. He's right. Those idiots in the Bronx. They were people. Yeah. You seek to justify your actions. To pretend all the chaos and destruction you wrought has meaning. I can't think of anything more meaningful than the creation of a whole new world. The Void is full of worlds. Many more pleasant than this. Why am I even talking to you? This is between me and Melcaressa. The peanut gallery can shut up now. What did you do? Relax, they're just asleep. I may not have much power now, but I can do that at least. Besides, this is between you and me. So how about it? Will you merge with me willingly or not? Uh. What's your goal here? You want to become a god, is that it? I guess if you have to put a label on it i've always been good at playing roles after all breathing life into things i just want a place where i fit where i don't have to pretend and since it doesn't exist i have to make it any 
other ghost. I'm not dead. In case you weren't aware, my body is very much alive. I admit, it's not ideal. That's why I need your help. I absorbed a lot of knowledge from you, Melkaressa. But there's so much more I need to learn. That information is locked up inside your head. Well, my head. Yes, Melkaressa. As long as you were in my head, I could learn anything. All I had to do was think, and the knowledge appeared in my brain, as if it was there all along. It was like learning my lines without ever needing to read the script. You taught me about the Dryad trapped in the North Woods, the Dragon in Chinatown, the Merfolk's War, but I can't access new information anymore. Not while we're separated. So here we are. Because you are a textbook, Melkaressa. You can't read yourself. That summoning spell you've been chanting? You only know it because you remember me casting it. Uh-huh. What if I say no? Oh, well, sure. You could say that. I can't stop you. But you can't exactly stop me either. That's my body. And I mean to have it back. As a sign of good faith? Sure. If you merge willingly. If not, well, I might not know how to create life yet, but I am very good at ending it. Okay. Because I don't want to fight you anymore, Melkaressa. It makes the work take so much longer, and it's exhausting. Working together will be so much easier, wouldn't you agree? If we merge, we'll stay in this world? Well, sort of. I mean, the energy to create this place has to come from somewhere. I created several pools of energy in the mundane world. They worked beautifully, too. Until you cut them off. So, before we do anything else, we'll need to make some more. Do you want to go back and hurt more people? Yes, but only temporarily. Just until we make this world self-sustaining. Five to ten years. Then I'll seal off the portal for good. We'll drift into the void and join the cosmos. <sighs> May I have a moment to think Take about it? Take all the time you want. I'm not going anywhere. And neither are you. Right. That's the problem now. Can't use that. No. Nope. Yeah, that's, that's not gonna, not gonna, gonna work, work here. here. Sorry. Okay. Well, well I'm waiting. waiting. All right. Actually, take all. I'm gonna save this since we've reached the end game. There are multiple end. There are four different endings. Wait, wait, wait. what are, what you, are doing? you doing? What does it look like? Wait, wait just, just wait. Wait, wait, wait. This is crazy. Why would you do this? This is your body, not mine. You need to be stopped. No, no it's, it's not. not. You're in a human body! You'll, You'll die, die a human death! Is that what you really want, Melkaressa? As long as it stops you, I can live with it. Do I want it? No. Will I do it? You're yes. insane! You're human now! You could become a ghost! A, a helpless, mewling ghost! And so would I! I won't let that happen. I can't let that happen. Maybe there's... there's... What? Tell me. Free me. You mean... No, 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 there has to be another way. 
great. All my knowledge, all the power that sustains this world, it comes from you. If you're gone, you'll be just like everyone else again. You'll just be like everyone else, everybody else again. Fine, fine, you win, Elcaressa. You're free. You're free. I release you. Go. Go back into the darkness where you came from. All right. Let's see what I've done. What the... Jesus, my head. Yeah. Did we win? Oh. Oh, it's you people. What happened? I no longer sense Melcaressa's presence. Melcaressa's gone. Now get out of my way. Ah. Donnie, it's me. Have I got a caller for you? <laughs> With no powers and no veil, she didn't have a chance. The evidence was overwhelming. The trial took weeks. The press had a field day. But in the end, the jury took ten minutes. Multiple life sentences with no possibility of parole. Donnie's been on TV every day talking about the case. He's basically super cop now, and that's fine. Yeah. The kid deserves it, and I get to lord it over him, which is what being a big sister is all about. I got a call from Harrison not long ago. She was in the hospital. She wanted me to kill her. She was in so much pain she could barely move. The usual medications weren't working. The docs were clueless. Mm. Turns out, the general got a mortal wound in battle. A wound so bad that Harrison could feel it over their link. Ouch. I didn't kill her. She can do her own dirty work for once. Mm. So we finally got a computer. Although Logan and KK use it to play their game most of the time. But it turns out, Travis and Winnie Cook have a very active social media profile. They're back in Florida. They seem happy if the pictures are anything to go by. And speaking of pictures, they post lots of Elijah. Sometimes a dozen every day. It hurts being away from family. But this makes it better. Somehow. I suppose I can live with that. Yep. I went to a meeting in Chinatown not long ago. Decided to stop in at the Dragon Tree. Turns out it's a drugstore now. One of those national chain things. Kevin moved upstate, rented himself a place with the money he got from his lottery winnings. But 50 grand doesn't last as long as it used to. He's working as a short order cook at a local diner. <laughs> from what I hear, he's made the joint pretty popular. Might be running the place before too long. I hope it works out for him. A mania has gripped Brooklyn. A troop of performers have remained on the Prospect Park band shell for weeks, refusing to leave. <laughs> Several groups of graffiti artists have been painting every wall available becoming violent when asked to stop. Mm. Writers, playwrights, and creative types of all sorts have been arrested for causing civil unrest. Mm. They all have one thing in common. They belong to an art collective led by Stanley Bates. Mm. I went to confront him, but he is no longer living there. We shall find him and deal with him one day. As for Melcarissa, we do not know. It is tempting to use the summoning ritual, but to perform it requires a death, and that is a line we will not cross. And regardless, Melcarissa is free now. Taking away that freedom would be wrong. So we venture on. Enemies are defeated. Wrongs are righted. And the wall against the darkness holds for yet another day. Now, I like this ending. That was... an interesting one. Mm. No kidding. They ate the radiator. Who eats a radiator? <laughs> Gremlins are the worst, huh? <laughs> All I know is Mitch will never let me borrow his car again. <laughs> hey, you guys hungry? There's a new Thai place down that way. Is it spicy? Probably. Why? Eli has 
trouble digesting spicy food. He's a fire mage! <laughs> Beckett, I've seen you drink lava. <laughs> Believe it or not, lava isn't that spicy. <laughs> uh. I am Lula. I come across the void in search of conquest. Stand down, creature. We will show no mercy. What she said. Just with more char broiling. Yep. Nice. I've got those new polymer copper bullets. Been meaning to test them out. Guys, <laughs> when you kill him, could you make sure there's no ghost left behind? I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs> and that is the end of Unavowed. That was very fun. Thank you, David Gilbert. He's a legend. I do hope that there's going to be another one of these. This was a very fun adventure. There are also other endings I could go for this. Cast in no particular order. Oh, look at this. But I am glad we finished this. So, next time around, when it comes to where this would be in the playlist, I am actually going to be starting a Little Nightmares 2. I picked that up and it's going to be going in there. Yeah, that's the name I gave them. So. That's what you that look forward to, and I would also like to invite you to check other things that pop up on the channel at 3 p.m. Eastern every day in a two-week cycle. Uh, this includes such games as uh, the Zork franchise, current line Return to Zork, the last in the series chronology, as well as... The Spellcasting series, I'm on Spellcasting 101, Sorcerers Get All the Girls right now. Working through the Indiana Jones franchise, currently on Indiana Jones and the Infernal Machine. There's Ivy Dupler, she's a very talented person. Also, I am work I do runs through the game, I'm working on Shantae and the Pirate's Curse, I do runs through the game of Monstrum. I am working my way through Deponia, the complete journey, as well as the King's Quest franchise. I will be starting King's Quest VI, and these are all part of what premieres at 3 p.m. Eastern every day in that two-week cycle. Also at 10 a.m. Tuesday through Saturday, I have videos premiering. Uh, Tuesday, uh, Tuesday morning is usually a fic reading. Wednesday is a Final Fantasy game. If I'm not still on Final Fantasy VII at this point, I've moved on to another one of the first seven Final Fantasy games. Thursday is either is most likely Dead by Daylight, but sometimes I put on there uh, Monster 2. Friday is a fighting game, ladder mode, and Saturday is a retrospective for a game I've beaten. So you know this will be popping up on there. And this was a fun game to play. I enjoyed playing it. And until next time, everyone, take care, have fun, and goodbye all. <laughs>